name is Ellie, and today I have a lot of questions. Who did not hear about Rahav, this brave girl these days? She's all over the internet. She's in your morning newspaper. She's on TV. CBC, BBC, Financial Times, you name it, everywhere. It's an open society. Everyone knows everything. But I have a question. Who is she? Who are you, Rahab? The girl flies to Thailand and says, I'm in danger and I want to go to Australia. And there is the UN representative walking in like Prince Charming on his white horse, saving this poor girl. Bada boom, done. And who cares about Australia if there is Canada? Canada, a beacon of light for all those in need. A caring mother of all democracies and of all liberal values possible. How do you call it if not hypocrisy? Because there is me. And Canada is well aware of me and of my case. Because when I said I have been discriminated by Canadian government because of the type of my skin, this stalwart supporter of all Canadian values, of all liberal values, the Honorable Ahmed Hussein told me, tough luck. So I went, I naively went to the Federal Court of Canada, and there is only one good thing this did me. Now I know that my skin is not the only reason for discrimination. It turns out that my documents were stolen in the Embassy of Canada, and they were transferred to other people who use these documents, my documents, to enter Canada. You know what Canada did? They told me, you stop acting like that. Stop. No? Okay. Now your file says that your husband has been convicted of committing a crime in Canada. He had been convicting of a crime. Well, he was not even in Canada at that time. Did I talk to UN representative? Or the representative of any other organization? Any other Prince Charming? They want to know the only advice I've been given. I've been told, you go get yourself a good lawyer. Your situation is serious, so go get a lawyer. So, who are you, Raha? And whose act is all this? Why is Christoph Freeland telling that this brave new Canadian woman needs respect, while I'm told that telling the truth in the Federal Court of Canada is being a vexation? Why me, demanding a fair treatment and fair procedures applied to everyone else is being labeled as frivolity? And no one gives a heck. I'm not saying anything, I'm just asking questions. And I want direct and very honest answers.